Both states accept Tomlinson's right of entry into their territories and the requested declaration in those terms hardly advances matters. The court holds that Tomlinson has no valid reason to assume that his rights will not be respected by these states. By these states. The reasons for this conclusion are twofold. First, state practice in relation to Section 51E of the Belize Immigration Act and Section 81E of the Trinidad and Tobago Immigration Act does not suggest any incompatibility with the RTC or the 2007 conference decision. Second, the practice or policy of admitting homosexual nationals from other CARICOM states, not falling under the two exceptions mentioned in the 2007 conference decision, is not a matter of discretion, but is legally required based on Article 9 of the RTC, as this is an appropriate measure within the meaning of the, that provision. Given the transformation of this treaty provision into domestic law, this legal requirement equally exists within the domestic legal order of a member state notwithstanding a real or apparent contradictory provision in the National Immigration Act. <clears throat> As to costs, the Court takes into account Part 31, Rule 1, Sub Rule 3 of the original Jurisdiction Rules 2015, which states that in exceptional circumstances, the Court may order that the, courts, the costs be shared or that the parties bear their own costs.